Hey guys, what's happening? Speed Inferno here, and we are back again with another Forza Horizon 4 gameplay video. This time, taking a look at Dom's Dodge Charger in Forza Horizon 4. And a special thanks once again to Microsoft and Playground Games for sending me a full copy of Forza Horizon 4 so I can show it off to you guys. But yeah, let's take a look at this charger now. It's not the exact charger that Dom used. Uh, but it's pretty close. It's the 1969 Charger, and I believe Dom used the 1970 Charger in uh, Fast and Furious. And by the way, let me know which car was your favorite in the Fast and Furious. Post it in the comments down below. But we're going to do some basic upgrades to this car to get things started, and we might even do a part two as well. But let's take a look here and see what we can do. So let's go and jump into... Uh, the customization, the visual customization of Dom's Charger, starting off with the hood. And you can see that this thing has some serious horsepower underneath it. Um, but we're going to back out here and go into our garage, go to upgrades and tuning, and then go to custom upgrade. Now, you can go in here and go to body kit presets, and then go ahead and get this preset right here, which basically lowers the car, changes the hood, and I believe it also will change the... Uh, rims as well and do a lot of other things but uh that's a little bit too expensive for me at the moment i think it's like a hundred thousand dollars at the moment that's half of my money so i'm going to start off uh more simple go up the custom upgrade guys and then go into uh appearance here go to the hood and then we can select it right here i already own it so i already bought it so that's going to save me money right there and then if i go to our rims we should be able to access tire and rims right here we can go ahead and choose something similar to uh, what we saw in that body kit. I think that's going to be pretty similar. Maybe. I'll have to see. But we're going to go with something like that. I think that works. Let me know which one would you go with for Dom's car. We're going to go with that one just for now. And again, I can make changes to this in the future. I'm planning on doing a part two uh, of this Dom's Dodge Charger build. But we're going to do that right there. And then uh, I'm thinking about also taking a look at the, um, let's see, conversion. See how much that is. If it's too much, we might not be able to do it. But uh, actually, not too bad. Let's see how much does that give us. Gives us a little bit more power in that area. Now this, what else is there? The engine swap is going to be a lot more expensive, of course. That's 50,000. We could do the engine swap. We could bring clear up to 700. Um, I think that's what it was. 700 and... Did I say 708? Kind of hard to read, but... Engine swap, 50,000. Let's do it. Let's bring up to 708 horsepower and really give this some power, guys. And again, we can continue to upgrade this uh, in upcoming videos. So let me know if you want to see a part two on Dom's charger. Uh, but let's go ahead and purchase all of this stuff and install the setup and take it out for a spin in the open world of Forza Horizon 4, which is just awesome, by the way. I've been really enjoying the full game. Uh, and since I have access to the full game early, you know, let me know, guys, what do you want to see? Uh, I can pretty much record everything and anything. Uh, so let me know what cars do you want to see? What events would you like to see? Uh, don't be afraid to post in the comments below and let me know. But yeah, let's take this beast out for a ride. Man, I love this car. Absolutely love this car. And uh, I really enjoyed the last Fast and Furious movie, uh, Fate of the Furious. I believe that was the last one. Um, but it had some really funny moments in it and uh, some really over-the-top action. More so than the previous movies. Oh no, we're going off-road! But as you, as you guys can see, we are playing during the autumn season, and then in about four days, it's going to roll over to the next season um, with some new events. So let's go and go to the map here, and let's go to a racing event. We're right here near this one. I already did this one, but I'm going to race it again anyway because... We can still earn some credits from it and have fun with this racing event. It's a road event, so it's, I think it's going to be perfect 
for our Dodge Charger. I don't really want to do any off-road or cross-country events with it. I think I'm going to stick to like the Subaru for that one for now. But uh, yeah, let's give this Dodge Charger a spin on the road circuits and see how it performs against all of the other muscle cars in its class. It's so beautiful. The environment in this game is just absolutely stunning, especially during the fall. I mean, I just love all the colors. Okay, we're pulling up. Here we go. This is the Reservoir Sprint. Oh, this is going to be interesting. So we're going to do solo. Uh, and in the future, I want to do some co-op races with you guys. Uh, some PvP races and, and stuff like that. And I'm thinking about also opening up a Discord here at Speed Inferno, Speed Inferno, where we can all get into the Discord and plan some race events, you know, maybe like once a week or something like that. So let me know if you'd like to see this happen. But let's do this, guys. We are going to race on the Reservoir. I think I have the difficulty set to... Um, highly skilled AI at the moment, so this is going to be pretty tough. This is probably going to come down to the wire. This is actually a point-to-point -point race, too. For a second, I thought it was a circuit event, circuit event, but it's not. Okay, let's go, 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 go! Have to break early. Gonna be sliding all over the place. Look how shiny it is. It's so beautiful. Dom knows how to polish his cars. Takes care of it. Go, 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 go. Living one quarter of a mile at a time. That's the way we roll. Whoops. Sorry, dude. Kind of. Well, not really. Okay, we're coming up on another dodge here. Hurry, 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 hurry. Be careful. Break it. Slamming the brakes. Man, even with slamming the brakes, I still hit the wall. I think that downhill kind of gave me too much momentum. Okay, we are passing the dodge. We got third place. We are on the podium. Can we get first place? That's the question. Will the upgraded horsepower come through? Returning, returning, returning. Wow, you gotta really slow down for these 90, 90 degree uh, corners here. Let's go across. We are crossing the reservoir. That's so cool. Man, I'm telling you, this is kind of tough. So we are at 51% halfway through the race, guys. The first place dude is getting away from us. This is not good. We got some uh, tricky roads up ahead. Some tricky bends. We gotta be careful. Easy, easy, easy. I think we're catching up just a little bit. Just enough, hopefully. Okay, it's gonna require me to slow down. Oh no! Ah, oh, man, I'm gonna try not to use the rewind feature at all. Like,. I'm trying to avoid that at all costs. I hate using the rewind function. I think you can actually shut it off completely. Ooh, getting some more influence. Going across, 84%. It's gonna be tricky, I gotta slow down, slow down, slow down. I don't know if I'm gonna make this. Dude, this is coming down to the last corners. Ooh, maybe I will. Slow down, slow down, slow down. Don't want to make a mistake at the end. Easy, easy, easy. This is coming down to the wire. Oh, man, that was nuts. I bet he's on this screen. Yeah, but you can see him behind me. Woo, that was close. That was not even a second ahead on that one. So, the Dodge Charger proves its worth. There you go. Let me know if you enjoyed Dom's Dodge Charger. Again, I know it's not the exact Dodge Charger, but hey, 
we're working with what we're given in Forza Horizon 4, and uh, I think it's pretty close. I really enjoyed racing with it. Let me know what other cars, events, uh, and challenges you want me to feature on Speed Inferno. I'm really looking forward to uh, doing a lot more videos on Forza Horizon 4. I'm really enjoying the game so far and absolutely love it. But guys, hit that like button if you enjoyed. Also, be sure to subscribe for more Forza Horizon uh, videos. And look at that. I got myself a hatch tea. Cool. All right, guys. I'll see you next time and enjoy the rest of your day.